Attorneys are going through jail phone calls of the sole suspect in the disappearance of Jolene Cummings. Kimberly Kessler is accused of kidnapping and killing her co-worker, who was also a mother of three. Action News Jack has been following this story since Cummings disappeared in May. Action News Jack's Beth Rousseau is live at the Nassau County Courthouse. And Beth, the final report on whether she's competent to stand trial could be delayed. And the judge expressing a lot of frustration today inside the courtroom at how this process is moving forward. Kimberly Kessler's attorney says realistically, if she is deemed competent, it could be 90 to 120 days before they're ready to go to trial. The question of Kimberly Kessler's competency at the center of this hearing. In February, Action News Jack showed you Kessler's first time facing a judge accused of kidnapping and murdering Nassau County mother of three, Jolene Cummings. She wasn't in court today, but her attorney says the report on her mental competency will be delayed. The court is offering you a longer amount yes. of time. I don't see what the problem is. I'm trying to just be realistic about when the case can be tried instead of coming back here every Every Action News Jacks obtained these documents saying attorneys are going through 19 discs of Kessler's jail phone calls. Judge Robert Foster says his concerns are when the trial will happen. My frustration is I don't feel like I'm getting a good faith answer about realistically when this case can be tried. And I just, it seems like I've got to keep coming back and back and back. Judge Foster has granted the defense team's request to depose Cummings' estranged husband, Jason Cummings, and alleged romantic interest, Jason G. Kessler is expected in court in April for a status hearing. Reporting in Nassau County, Beth Russo, CBS 47, Action News Jax.